The state is tracking the new COVID variant BA.2. The governor's team says that it is on the rise in the state. But there is good news, too. News Channel 13's Rachel T.D. joins us live here in the studio to explain. Rachel, good Hi, Mark evening. Hi, Well, Governor Hochul's team said today that 99.5% of COVID cases are the Omicron variant right now. But this new variant, a sub-variant of Omicron, makes up about half of that 99.5% number. Hochul's team said BA.2 is more transmissible, but not more severe. They pushed regardless, test, 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 saying the treatment window is five days after you show symptoms, so the sooner the better. Hochul said today, even though this strain is less severe, the state is keeping its focus on prevention. So we're not going to take our foot off the gas. We're protecting people with PPE tests, uh, vaccines and boosters, and making sure that the mask requirements in health care facilities remain in place. Also, we're watching the, the issue in Washington about a fourth dose. And I'm very anxious to get uh, that approval, if, that, if that's determined by the CDC, to be the next best defense against this variant. Hochul also announced today she wants to invest $750 million to rebuild the, the Wadsworth Center, rather, and spend $10 billion to grow the health care workforce by 20% over the next five years. Reporting in studio with coverage you can trust, Rachel Teedy, News Channel 13.